Good morning. If you have decided to study and you want to become a professional hypnotherapist, keep watching our training videos about clinical hypnosis. Hypnotherapy is an effective technique with which you can help and improve the quality of life of a great number of your future patients. Remember, read the description of this video where you can find a link to free training classes on clinical hypnosis and also you can download cell ebooks also free. The information in this video is extracted from our book Direct Clinical Hypnosis, Deep Hypnosis, of our publisher Clinical Hypnotherapy, registered with ISBN. Direct Clinical Hypnosis, Aversive Exercises for Smoking, Part 2. Aversive Flavor Smoking, Commented. This exercise can be associated to an aversive exercise. To do so, we must find out which is the taste that the patient dislikes the most. The aversive exercise is based on making the patient feel that taste under hypnosis. Then, it is associated to the act of smoking. From now on, every time you light a cigarette and take a puff, it will have a strong, unpleasant taste of the unpleasant taste that the patient previously told us. Example. Now I want you to visualize how every time you addiction ingested compulsion, you will notice that it has a very unpleasant taste of use the most aversive taste for the patient whose information will have obtained in the clinical interview. It is an unbearable taste of unpleasant taste for the patient. You find it impossible to bear it. You feel like vomiting so much so that you have to throw away the adjective object that is ingested, believing that it was in bad condition, you take another one. The result is the same. It still has an intense, unpleasant, an unbearable taste of unpleasant taste for the patient. From now on, all objects have this unbearable taste of unpleasant taste for the patient, which totally prevents you from eating it, smoking it, savoring it, etc. Aversive hospital smoking. I want you to visualize how you are coughing, always coughing. You feel like you are choking. You find it very hard to breathe. Your lungs are damaged from smoking. You feel bad, very bad. You decide to go to the doctor for a checkup. You are in the doctor's room. He has the results of the various tests he has done. The doctor looks at you with a very serious face. He stares at you. You start to feel scared. You start to get scared. He stares at you seriously. At the same time, he tells you that you have an irreversible disease, incurable. He tells you that you have an irreversible disease, incurable. He tells you that you have cancer and you have very little time left. You are in the terminal phase. He tells you that you are going to die a horrible death, full of chest pain, with choking, with a lot of coughing, and finally with a very painful death, because you will die choking on your own blood, all because of tobacco. I want you to visualize yourself on your deathbed, coughing, choking, barely able to breathe feeling yourself suffocate, unable to say a word. You're coughing, coughing up a mouthful of blood with each cough. You're finding it harder and harder to breathe. You feel like you're fish out of water, gasping for air, trying your best to get some air into your lungs. You feel like you're suffocating, unable to breathe, Sprouting blood and fluids 
out of your mouth. You feel bloated. You feel all this suffering. Feel it. You are going to die. You will stop enjoying the company of loved ones and closest ones, even pets. Another example. You will stop enjoying the company of your daughter. You will stop watching them grow up. Without you, your daughters will be lost. You will stop enjoying the company of your husband. Without you, he will fall into a deep depression and stop taking care of your daughters. You will stop enjoying your dogs. If you die, your dog will die of grief. You will stop enjoying your family. You will stop enjoying life and your family. You will stop enjoying life and everything you love to do. It's all over. What a disgusting and horrible way to die. Now you feel like you want to do things. You would like to do things. You are still young. It's too late. You are drowning. You are suffocating. It's the end. To avoid all this, now you never light a cigarette again. You never smoke again. Smoking is over. From now on and on, you will take care of yourself. You take good care of yourself. Now you live without smoke. You live in a healthy way. You never smoke. Now you live without tobacco. You live without smoking. You live without smoking. You never smoke. Now you live without tobacco. You live without smoking. You feel great without tobacco. You feel great without smoking. Now you live without tobacco. You live without smoking. If you're interested in learning more about clinical hypnosis, watch our next video. Direct clinical hypnosis. Aversive exercises for cocaine detoxification. Part 1. Remember, read the description of this video where you can find a link to free training classes on clinical hypnosis. And also, you can download self free ebooks. If you have questions, add them in the comment area. On this topic and many others, we'll talk about in the channel and in the videos that we'll publish. So, if you're interested, do not miss our next videos. Thank you very much.